A Somerset Pony Club has launched a campaign to save endangered Exmoor foals from slaughter. It wants to prove there is a market for them in the wider equestrian world. It comes in light of a new report commissioned by Exmoor National Park, which raised the idea that the breed could be farmed for meat like cattle and sheep for sale to local hotels and restaurants. Spotlight's Janine Jansen reports. Dawn Westcott wants to give Exmoor foals a lifeline. When they come off the moor, they're wild and frightened of humans. She takes months to socialise them. The problem has been that it's been very difficult for the moorland farmers to find the buyers uh, and actually present the foals in a form where people can handle them because sometimes people are very daunted about taking a wild foal off the moor. Um, but quite often people don't know how to buy a foal from a moorland farmer and the moorland farmer doesn't know, you know how to find the potential buyer. Dawn says the lack of a market for foals means more than 100 get culled each year. So far, she's saved 18 foals. But she says they've had big problems buying them due to red tape. It's something being addressed in a new report commissioned by the Exmoor National Park into the welfare and future of Exmoor ponies. The report also mentions the possibility of marketing the pony meat to local restaurants, a point it says will invoke reactions of horror and disgust in those opposed to meat-eating. Farmer Rex Milton welcomes Dawn's foal socialisation programme, but says ponies do have to be managed. I think what you've got to look at is that there is a natural degree of wastage with any good management and breeding. And we are interested in producing good stock off of the moor, but we need somewhere for the substandard stuff to go. So I think that's we're looking at a very limited amount, but it was suggested that as a speciality market, it could possibly be a, a, a dish that was rather a speciality. The moorland farmers have just set up their own group to help protect their herds for the future. The Exmoor Pony Society has refused to comment until after the consultation period closes at the end of this month. Janine Jansen, BBC Spotlight, Exmoor.